Checking in with Rob Ellis for our first mm. alert weather and what a Saturday we have out there. Beautiful. We had a little bit of haze this morning. Mm -hmm. Some wildfire smoke was going to be a concern. I was thinking about that because there were so many people outside. Yeah. But now we've really got some pretty nice conditions. The humidity is on the lower side. That will be changing though. So as we get through tonight and into tomorrow, the humidity is going to start to move up. So I hope you enjoyed today. Tomorrow will certainly be much warmer. Temperatures into the 80s. Currently 83 is not so bad. We've got 70s for some of you, especially in the northwest Indiana, where the temperatures started out close to the 40s this morning. If you can believe that, that's a testament to the dry air that was in place. But that's all about to change. I showed you this. I said looking to the west, we would be seeing some temperatures. Look at the uh, 98 in Kansas City currently. Boy, those temperatures are moving our way, but I think the heat that's going to be moving our way for tomorrow is only going to be brief. It'll only be here for tomorrow. So keep that in mind. Just wanted to reset my computer because I wanted to show you some of those clear sky conditions that we have out there. Guaranteed rate field. Look at all of the blue sky coming in again. Most of the wildfire smoke has uh, moved out, so it's not as hazy as it was, but Overall, still a pretty nice weekend. Um, overall, when you put the two days together, Saturday and Sunday, if you like the summertime heat, it is here. 80s today. Overnight, I do think we'll see the temperatures drop back down to around 70, so not quite as cool as it was this morning. And then plenty of sunshine for tomorrow. We're headed for the 90s tomorrow. 92 is what I'm expecting for O'Hare. It will be a little bit cooler along the lakefront, but areas to the west, we could see those temperatures get into the 90s, and the feels like temperatures could surpass 100 degrees. And this is one of the reasons why we're concerned uh, with the uh, folks that may be susceptible to uh, heat concerns. That's why heat advisory is in place. Look at this, though. It's brief. We cool down a little bit as we get into from Sunday to Monday, and then the temperatures start creeping up again. We do have temperatures back into the 90s, mid 90s for Wednesday and Thursday, and that could come with some dangerous heat as well. So our concern here is that not only is this going to be the hottest part of our forecast, but it's also going to be the most humid part of our forecast. So Wednesday and Thursday, the humidity will be there. The heat will be there. We do expect the temperatures potentially to surpass feels like temperatures to surpass 100 degrees. It's why we're giving you alert days on Wednesday and Thursday. Both of those days, the heat could be in the dangerous category. Good news is that should last a couple of days before the temperatures start to ease back down Friday and into the weekend. Rain chances this entire forecast look relatively small. They're scarce until we get to about Saturday. Otherwise, partly cloudy skies for the next few days and temperatures are certainly feeling like summertime. Oh, definitely. Rob, thank you so much. Appreciate that.